there was a mean McDonald's on the corner of Hoyne and Madison. I remember the first time I went in. Some of the lights were off and it looked like they hadn't cleaned up in a while. The woman at the counter was staring at me. As I got closer to her, she said, I hate you, in a loud voice. I was taken aback, but the silence that followed was uncomfortable, so I ordered a number nine. The lady pretended to vomit, then rang it up. As I was leaving with my food, the cooks threw burgers at the windows near me. For a while, I kind of forgot about that, but several months later, a friend and I happened to walk past. The employees were barking like dogs at us out the windows, which alarmed my friend. I craned my neck a little and noticed that the floor inside was covered in mouse traps. Mean McDonald's. I tried calling the McDonald's corporate headquarters, but got flustered when I heard myself describing the situation out loud and hung up on them. Whenever I was in the area, I felt compelled to walk past the mean McDonald's. Morbid curiosity, I suppose. Once, it seemed empty and I hesitantly entered the store. A bucket of cold water fell on me and someone ran up, took my picture, and called me a buffoon. The next time I walked past, an employee was pretending to feed a hamburger to a printed out picture of my face. The time after that, a bunch of pit bulls were attacking a dummy with my picture taped to it, while the staff watched and clapped rhythmically. I got a new job and never had time to visit the mean McDonald's anymore. In the summer, I read that it had been shut down after they put a lit firecracker in someone's ear. The news story made me hungry for McDonald's. <laughs>